Last time we looked at the new Bailey Olympus for this program, they've invited us into their Bristol factory for a look at the changes they've made to build their new Anutech body shell. There are two key areas for change. The panels that make up the outer skin of the caravan and the joining technology that puts the vehicle together. First we're going to look at the panels. These panels are constructed from the outside in. So that's the outer aluminium skin being prepared for the assembly process. The adhesive that coats the outer skin is laid down in beads rather than being sprayed for accuracy of application and to reduce air pollution from overspray. Now the core of the panel can be assembled and it's all composite plastic material including the brown framework members there's no wood in the panel so there can never be any rot from damp or water leakage the brown framework pieces are low absorbency plastic which reduces the possibility of water ingress they frame all of the areas around the doors windows and locker doors The assembly team are guided through their job by an overhead laser guide that projects positions onto the panel itself, so the part being installed will be in exactly the right place. It's quite like putting a jigsaw together, but every step is carefully planned and executed. The team making panels do this every day, but with only around a thousand Alutec vans having passed through the factory so far, spread across the range of models and sizes, they take their time to get things exactly right. We were impressed with the level of care that went into this assembly. Bailey have always worked on their green credentials and here's another example leaving void areas like these windows unfilled during the gluing process. These will be filled after the adhesive is cured so that the filling, the aluminium skin and the GRP skin can easily be separated for recycling. This coat of adhesive will bond the glass reinforced plastic inner skin in place to complete the panel assembly. Today, the team are using a pre-cut inner skin for this side panel. Pre-cutting saves wasted time when they're changing from roof to side panels. Bailey will soon be adding a third lamination line to the factory, which will mean that each line will be able to make just one kind of panel, although in the various lengths required for the various models. into the press next to clamp all the parts together for the next step, the router.
We've now switched from a side panel to a roof panel, so you can see some of the roof features. And in the Alutech system, the roof includes the whole front of the caravan, made as one. Because the body panels are so accurately put together, the router can cut out the windows, doors and all the locker and other apertures. It also cuts out the locations of the Alutech body shell clamps that hold the panels together under the aluminium external extrusion. Because this is a roof panel, it has to have two side support pieces added before it can be dressed with its roof lights and other openings. You'll see why this is so important when we see the Alutech body being assembled in the main plant in our next program. The apertures, like roof lights, are now finally taken out with operators just cutting through the tags left by the router. This is also the moment when the spacers are fitted to ensure that the body panels fit together in exactly the right location to accommodate the Alutech extrusion. Last step, the panels are dressed with their doors and windows by experts who make it all look easy.